schedule long time no see i have a flight at 8 a.m but basically i have to be there at 6 a.m to check in and it is currently 10 p.m right now and i just finished packing i'm already in my airport outfit i'm literally gonna sleep in this but yeah this time i'm going somewhere for a long longer time than i did last time that i traveled this necklace i literally just unboxed yesterday it's from yestel this blazer i literally just thrifted i honestly didn't even wash it yet and then i thrifted this vest too it's a men's vest but i just love the brownie tones it's like really cute for fall and then this white shirt is from yes doll these pants are from that one what's that one store i literally just did a haul for them but i love these cargo pants and then i also just barely got these shoes yesterday from yes doll and then my socks are from korea okay this is the situation okay stop it okay so these two suitcases are actually vintage um because they really beat up your suitcases international that's why i don't have those blue ones anymore i got this one on amazon as my personal item and it says that you could pack a week's worth of items in here but i'm gonna use it as my personal item i'll link it down below it's from amazon but yeah this is what i decided to pack for almost I think I'm gonna be gone for like three months, so the whole bed is for three months. And guys, I finally trying these pouches that I see everyone use like when they're packing. And I'm finally using the packing cues and they make it more organized. I can't believe I'm so late to them, but I got these on Amazon too. By the way, shout out to this IKEA mirror. It was perfect to like check all the clothes I want to try today. It's such a good mirror. I recommend it. It's from IKEA. Look how nice and compact my packing shoes are. This is how the packing bags look. Actually, I feel like made it like more tidier and compact, which I appreciate. Okay, this is my check-on bag, so I want to put like stuff I can't put in my carry-on. I want to bring this tray in case I need one for my phone. I don't know why, I want to bring candles because I love Korea cakes. Pads. One of my jewels said that this was bad. Is it true? Okay, these are the toiletries I have. I wash my hair a lot when I'm in Korea, so I just went in about three. And this is a technique so it doesn't spill everywhere. Random bag. Oh, I want to show you guys this. I got this from Yesta as well recently. It's the one that Jenny has. I'll link it down below. Use my coupon, Lily Julie, for percent off. Guys, this is literally the one that Jenny has. It's gonna keep me warm. I'm gonna put this right here. Oh my gosh, it's fitting perfect. I don't know why, but I have a feeling I wanna wear this. So I'm gonna be there in Christmas, so. Okay, I'm basically spending the winter there, so I'm going to show you guys how many outerwear I'm bringing. So, I'm bringing a pepper jacket in case it's snowing. I have a long, long trench coat. Black blazer is so a classic. And then the one I'm wearing to the airport. Don't bring big towels to Korea because I did twice and I always regret it. I always end up throwing it away. So I found this one at IKEA and it even has something where you can hang it on. So it's perfect. I recommend this towel if you're going to Korea. Not small, but it's not big. It was only $1.99. Excuse me. What? She's trying to go in my personal item. Yeah, guys, you literally could put your shoes in here. You could put like weeks worth of clothes in here. You could, there's a hot cold section, but I don't need that yet. And also I really like, of course, for your laptop. Okay, we're ready, Mochi. Already. <laughs> Did you scratch 
Ich gehe mal noch ein downstairs. Okay, I love you. I made it to Korea. 14 hours to get here from Canada. And I'm gonna take the airport bus because it's cheaper. It's only $14, I think. And then if I took a taxi, it's like $57. So I can't wait to go shower. I feel really musty. I'm here in the hotel. First of all, there's no elevator, so yeah, I'm so exhausted from bringing these up here. When you guys are looking for Airbnb, you check to see if there's an elevator. This one has a really small bathroom. It's like, look at that. And then you come in. I really am happy there's a mirror because that's one of the things I need every day. Okay, the fridge, air con, the bed, and I like that there's storage underneath. So the bus was actually pretty fast. And the bus driver was really nice. He dropped me off nearby. It was still like a seven minute walk. So I had to do cacao taxi. And none of the general taxis would take me. So I had to do a black taxi, which is like more. $11 to get to here instead of walking for seven minutes. But it's okay, it's late and I'm, I don't want to be walking around with three luggages. So ready, freshen up, brush my teeth and everything. Put on some makeup because I... Last thing I want to do is go to the peony jump. Yay! I haven't been in so long, guys. Okay. Oh my gosh, you guys. I fell asleep last night after I freshened up. I don't know why I laid in bed and all of a sudden, I woke up today. So, I'm going to go to the convenience store now. It is 7 a.m. Mm, this is the fit. <laughs> okay, let's go. I filmed the TikTok. I finally got the drink. It says. It's pretty good. It's kimchi ham. Like, I must think it's weird that I'm eating spicy food in my talk about them more when I get home. I went to a nearby dentist who does speaks English so yeah. Guys I went to the dentist and it was a hundred dollars for the consultation so I said I will come back another day. I want to compare it with this other dentist I was going to try. I'm going to go try street food. I saw some. <laughs> Okay, let's try it out. Murka tam tiki. So murka is like a huge problem in Korea. So this was only two two dollars USD. There's 
chew in here. I could give one to a friend. This is kind of creepy, guys. That's my wig. It's so creepy right now. <laughs> Yay, guys. I just went around the whole room and in the bathroom. Too. Go to your video mode on any phone that has a flash. So you push record with the flash on. And then you cover the lens with it. And your phone will look like this. Like right around the whole room. And what you're looking for is like a beeping, beeping light. And like right here, you guys can't see anything. Yeah. Hidden cameras are so bad in Korea. So today was really long. Today felt like five days. Because I did... I did every- I forced myself to do everything I wanted to do today. Ooh, I love my new lenses. I almost forgot I had them on. They're so comfortable. First of all, if you guys come to Korea, I need to update your prescription. They do it there. But I already knew my prescription, so she did it for me. Mine is negative 2.50. I told her, like, from, like, the moment I met the old lens worker, I told her that I couldn't speak Korean well. She was so- still so helpful and open to helping me, and yeah. I'm so happy these last three to six months and they're $40. Okay, next I went to the hair salon. Literally like right next to where I got my Olin's. Yeah, they were two nice ladies. I've done my nails at Uni Stella before and if you guys saw the last vlog I did last year. It was kind of luxurious because that's where like Blackpink does their nails but it was expensive. So when they told me it was only like $129 which is like $95 in USD. I just went ahead and did the white one because you guys helped me on instagram pink the pink ones but she told me that it would be only my natural nails and be like 39 dollars so that's like 40 dollars so i just went ahead and paid 100 dollars for the nails that i actually really want which is like these like the clean girl aesthetic next the dentist thingy my friend told me that some places do consultations for free good thing i told that person that i wanted to wait because they were telling me it was a hundred dollars and then what happened next yeah i just also been filming tiktok all day i need to work on this video now sorry guys that's taking forever that's so creepy right <laughs> it's just my wig bye Okay, you're gonna go me, Kuya. <laughs>